Hi guys, happy Sunday. So my happy mail just came and I'm so, so excited to show it to you and so excited to use it finally in a video. Um, it's been a couple of days and I've definitely been waiting for this to come. Okay, so all of this makeup is Arbonne and I wanted to show it to you because it's so good. Hi, Chels. Um, I, I'm going to go through the kit on what came first and then I'm going to tell you a little bit about the products and switching and, you know, toxicities and stuff like that. I'm going to keep it light and fun though because nobody wants to be bored. Okay, so in my bundle, I'm going to show you everything that came so you know if you want to get the bundle exactly what's in it. I want to first start off with, it came with two free gifts. So they sent me a whole bunch of hair care samples in here because Arbonne also does hair care, skin care, baby stuff, men's lines, nutrition, as well as the makeup. Um, and I got a free face wash with my order. So this is the micro exfoliating cleanser, um, the RE9 Advanced. So I'm super excited. This was a pretty expensive bottle that they just sent me for free and I got to pick a free gift. So go with the expensive. I also got a free night cream. So when you're a preferred customer, you get 20 to 40% off of my site all the time. Hi, Andrea. So you get 20 to 40% off the site no matter what you're getting, whenever you're getting it. Free shipping and every time you have a $150 order, that you get to pick a free gift. Like anything you want on the site. Hi, Angeline. All right, so this is what came in the kit. So I got Easy on the Eyes Eye Makeup Remover. Makeup Primer. So excited for that. Um, this is Skin Perfecting Liquid Foundation with SPF 15 in it. Um, Arbonne. Hi, Laura. Hi, Angeline. Uh, let's see. We have a peach lip liner. Hi, Allison. I have a fair liquid concealer. Uh, it's a fine line eye pencil in the shade Morel because I wanted to get something that I could use on my lips and on my eyes. Um, Arbonne blush in the shade Blossom. I have a lipstick in the shade Magnolia. I have Shape It Up Tinted Brow Cream in Light Medium. Uh, let's see what else we have. Sitting Pretty Translucent Loose Setting Powder. Glow On Bronzer. An eyeshadow palette. This all comes in the kit. Like this is not me adding a whole bunch of stuff to my cart. This is what comes in the kit. I have a light brow pencil. Because as you can see, oh, that's okay, Josh, keep it up. We have, a, we have a whole men's line and nutrition line. So this is makeup, but I have something for you. I have the blush, you only need a small amount, it goes a long way. You're absolutely right, Laura is so right. This stuff is so pigmented. I had borrowed um, some of my makeup from Jenny and tried it out and I was beyond impressed with it. And that was really one of the major factors in making my switch. Um, and I'm so happy that I did because I'm like I'm on a, a whole different trajectory right now and the nutrition has been a huge factor in like returning a little bit of sparkle to my eyes and a little kick in my step. Um, so the rest of the stuff that comes in here is um, a lip Arbonne Prime and Proper Eye Primer, Speak Volumes Mascara, and glossed over lip gloss in the shade Hazel. Hi Mariah, hi Victoria. Guys, say hi when you hop on. It's so glad to have you here with me. Okay, so I'm going to start with a little primer first. Like I said, it just came. Hi, Kim. Um, it just came in the mail, so I'm unboxing it with you right now. All right, so primer. Oh, nice and thick. Perfect. Hi, Chris. It smells like coconut. And it's incredible incredibly silky. So these are good things. Hi, Mariah. I'm so happy to see you. All right. This is really, really luxurious feeling. And it was a very small amount, but it spread out really, really evenly. And I'm, I'm a fan of that. So this is the primer. Hi, Julie. Don't worry. The videos are not going anywhere. I'm, I'm going to continue the videos. Plus, I'm going to be doing videos. I don't know if I'll do them on here or on Instagram um, with like recipes that I'm making. I've been adding the powdered greens to the kids shakes. They cannot detect that they're drinking 37 servings of fruits and vegetables in there. So that's huge because my kids are not normally good about that at all. Like Chase will eat vegetables, but he's not like mom. 
I need an extra serving. He does not care about that. But it makes me feel better as a mom to have, like, know that I'm doing the right thing with that. I also got some extra products um, that will be here this week. So this is just, like I said, the starter kit. So this is what they send when you can buy this kit too. It's a great value. I'd be happy to match you with colors and give you some advice on those things. Hi, Rosie. Um, so if you have questions, definitely reach out. We're using these together for the first time. So I will have questions too, but it's all, it's all good. All right, so I'm using Perfecting Liquid Foundation. This is Broad Spectrum SPF 15, which is huge for me because as you can see, I am incredibly fair skinned and I don't always put sunscreen on. I also got a CC cream, which is like the, the BB cream I used to use, um, and that has SPF 30 in it. Um, so this is the shade Soft Blush. So I'm just gonna put a little bit on the back of my hand. Hi, Megan. So I'm just gonna put a little bit on here and we're gonna blend it in just like we did um, liquid foundation. So this is, I would say it's slightly thicker than water weight, but the coverage is real. And I like that it's still light enough that I don't feel like I'm putting on like mayonnaise. Nobody wants a mayonnaise face. If you guys have any questions at any point, just let me know. I will answer them immediately. So I'm just using a wet eco tools sponge to blend this in. And it blends out beautifully. So the one thing you want to remember is that you want your primer to sit on your face for just a minute and sort of acclimate to your face before you go ahead and blend your foundation on top of it. So there's a couple of different makeup kits. You don't have to get the full Monty if you don't wear a lot of makeup. Um, I think that this is a great starter kit if you don't own makeup or you're trying to go tox free. Hi, Haley. Um, and I'm very pleased with that coverage. Very pleased with it. Okay, so that again is the liquid foundation with SPF. All right, so now let's go in with concealer. And I got Fair Concealer, the Real Conceal is what it's called. Again, everything here is vegan, non-GMO, organic, um, tox-free, not tested on animals, cruelty-free, um, soy-free, gluten-free, dairy-free, paraben-free, mineral-free, oil-free, all the things. All right, so this is how the concealer comes. What I like about this is I don't have to put this on my fingertips to like blend it out. Down my nose, on my forehead, chin. Well, that was easy, especially with the applicator. All right, so all the areas that I just did with the concealer, I wanted to highlight and brighten. Everything I should also mention is hypoallergenic. So if you have sensitive skin like I do, it's a great option for you. So we're just gonna blend that in with the back of this and just highlight and brighten. I did get a couple of things like a pressed powder that I'm gonna use, a pressed powder foundation that I'm gonna use as a concealer. Um, what else did I get? A couple of other shades of things that I just wanted to play with. You know, it's important for me always to show a variety of things in my videos, just like I always did. So I don't wanna just show you the same video, the same products every single day. That is super boring. We need variety. Hi, Mary. Okay, so that's all in, good to go. I'm going to take a little bit of the translucent setting powder, which I'm really excited. This is called Sitting Pretty Translucent Setting Powder. I'm really excited to use it because I heard that it smells like cupcakes. And um, let's see. I am not good with these. I'm gonna use the tweezers to open this puppy. Let me get the old sniff test. It definitely smells like cupcakes. <laughs> So I'm going to put this on a little powder brush. 
because I don't want to like overindulge in it. It's got like a shimmer shine to it. So it's going to give your face a little bit of luminosity. Hi, Michelle. Hi, Megan. And I'm just going to blend that in. Perfect. So it's got that nice little mesh catch in here so that you don't like go in way too hot with product, which we've all done from time to time. And I do not like to waste product. I like how light this feels. And I like that my skin still feels like skin. It doesn't feel like I've covered it up or like if there's something super heavy on it. So that definitely gets major bonus points because... I'm tough when it comes to that. Hi, Kim. All right. So that is Gucci. That is the setting powder. Now you can also, I don't do it because I try to put as little powder and makeup on my under eyes as possible because hashtag fine lines and wrinkles are not my friend. Um, but I don't bake under my eye. But if you are blessed genetically to not worry about those things, then you can always put a little extra translucent setting powder underneath here and just kind of bake your under eye if you ever feel like you get a little greasy there. All right, so now let's go with the Glow On Bronzer. So our, is the foundation full coverage? Yes. So there is um, liquid foundation, CC cream, which is a lighter foundation. Um, there's pressed powder foundation and there is loose powder foundation. So um, you definitely have your choice and I can send you, send me a message, Angeline, and I can send you over um, the information because I've been saving like the little tidbits that I've been learning until I get all of my stuff here to try out and demo for you. I've been sort of, there's a beautiful chart about sort of what your skin does, what you're looking for, what it's good for, and those types of things. So send me a message and I can help you. So this is um, the bronzer. It comes in one shade, so you don't really have to guess about what it is. So we're just gonna bronze up our face a little bit here. I like that this is cool because I tend to stay away from like red bronzers because I don't like the way that they make me look like I have a sunburn. So we're just gonna highlight. Contour the face, bring in a little bit of warmth. I feel like it's just a very natural kind of color here. Hi, Steph. Down the nose. And I'm not going for like a super sharp contour today at all. Just want something. We're going to take the kids to the movies later as long as Justin's feeling well. And that's life. That's life for a mom. So you can still do things with this makeup like I was doing with Unique. I'm just waiting for a lot of my products to arrive because I ordered them in stages. Um, so things like doing a, a sharper contour with a darker pressed powder foundation is absolutely still a possibility. And you will be seeing more of that as I kind of expand into this. Hi, Erin. Also, I have not had coffee in, it's been more than a week, 10 days, and I do not miss it. And I am a coffee connoisseur. I needed two cups just to get out the door in the morning. Hi, Erin, how are you? Um, I needed two cups of coffee just to get out the door in the morning. I needed a cup at three o'clock just to get through the rest of the afternoon and the evening. Hi, Kristen. Um, and I don't need that now because I'm drinking the fizz sticks with a detox tea and it's beyond good. I actually made Justin get on it. He loves coffee. And I was like, no coffee. You're doing one of these. And he's like, I actually really enjoy this. So we're going with that. All right. So I'm going to use the shade Blossom. And this is the pressed blusher. Such pretty shades of blush. I think I may have ordered a couple too many the other day because I got a little excited um, when I put in another order. So again, these, everything in here is hyper pigmented. So you don't need to go in like really heavy handed. So again, this is the shade Blossom, sort of like a peachy pink. And it's got a little bit of like a glow to it. I also love that none of the colors were like outrageous. You know how like you look at some palettes and you're like, where would I ever, 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 ever wear that? When I was going through the site, I wasn't looking at something and going, now who are they exactly trying to appeal to? Like it was very 
very good shades. Brow pencil, brow gel. Oh, I missed brow gel. Truly, I did. Okay, prime and proper. All right, so we're going to go in with the eyeshadow palette. So there's two different eyeshadow palettes. Hi, Donna. And um, I got the first one, which tends to be like a little bit more of the neutrals. Hi, Crystal. Oh my God, it's beautiful. This is totally like KKW Beauty right there, 100%. And I like the variety in it. These are gorgeous. These are really, 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 really pretty. All right, so I love neutrals, but I love neutrals with like a little swing. So I definitely have achieved that in here. Like, look at this color right here. Red Rock, amazing. This has a little bit of purple in it. I definitely wear greens quite a bit. Golds, oh my gosh, this is so pretty. All right, so I'm gonna start with the shade Sand, which is right here. And I'm just gonna blend that onto my lid and up into the crease. Blends out beautifully. And like I said, you do not need to be an Arbonne presenter to get this kit. There's no fallout. Again, just like what I was using before, hyper pigmented. So you don't need to go in really, really heavy handed. And then I'm going to take this shade Mahogany, which is like a darker sort of like berry purple. And I'm going to blend that right into the crease. Mahogany. What a nice shade. Do my lower lash line. So when you become a preferred customer with Arbonne, um, you always, oh, there's also a mirror in here so that you can kind of take this on the go. And I like how compact it is, huge. And then I'm gonna put, you know what, why stop there? I'm gonna put a little of this shade Desert because it's got a little of a metallic, and I'll put it right on the inside. Um, I can't wait for my glow palette to come this week. That has a whole bunch of different um, highlight shades on it, so I'm super excited for that. Hi, Kristen. But honestly, I'm excited with the highlight that is already on there because that setting powder that I used has like a metallic sort of shimmer to it, and not mad at that. It gave my face a little extra glow. All right, so now we're gonna go in with It's a Fine Line Eye Pencil and I'm using the shade Morel, which is like this sort of coffee brown. I was just saying something and now I can't remember what I was saying. It'll come to me. All right, so this is a nice big pencil. It is not a small pencil. Oh, and it's mechanical. Hi, Kristen. All right, so I'm just gonna drag a little of this right across my top lash line. Darken that in a touch. Just give it a little bit of extra boom on that lash. And I wanted this shade because I wanted to use it as an eyeliner too. A nice neutral brown. Hi, Kate. All right, so let's do brows. So it comes with two brow two brow products. So this is the brow pencil, and then it comes with a brow gel. Now, I used to use brow gel all the time when I first started sort of manicuring my eyebrows, and the whole reason behind that was I liked how it sort of kept them in line all day. So I'm gonna go in with the light Shape It Up brow pencil. I'm not brave enough to do lives, but I love my Arbonne makeup. Oh, good, Kristen. So excited to see this line of makeup. Thanks, Kate. All right, so just like always, we're gonna start at the front and move towards the back. This is definitely the right shade for me because my hair is so blonde right now. I definitely feel like it's a nice, clean, non-aggressive color. Hi, Alyssa. This pencil has good weight too, so that it's easy to draw. Okay. Go 
that arch in. My arch is gets like very weak over on this side. We're gonna go in with brow gel. Oh, I remember what I was saying. Um, it was something about, oh, preferred customers. So this is the Arbon brow gel. Nope, lied to you, that's lipstick. Where did I put my brow gel? I promise I had it, it was sitting like right here next to my brow stuff. Lip gloss. How does this happen to a human when she hasn't moved? Hi, D. This is something, something, guys. Brow gel. Lip gloss. Mascara, lip liner, eye makeup remover. This is not funny. How do I lose something when I haven't even moved it? Haha, <laughs> it's underneath something. Hi, Michelle. All right, so we're going in with Shape It Up Brow Gel in Light Medium. Um, so what I was saying was when you become a preferred customer, you get 20 to 40% off the website with free shipping and free gifts um, all year long. All right, so Brow Gel, it just has this little like wand on the end. And it just kind of, you paint it over your brows and it keeps everything basically in line all day and adds just a very subtle tint to it. Especially if you have longer or like more wiry brows, you will love brow gel. It's huge. All right, so let's go in with Speaks Volume Mascara and then I'll see if I wanna zhuzh up my eye a little bit more. I'm doing very, very neutral today. Wow, that is a significant tube of mascara. Arbonne Speaks Volumes Mascara. I like the sound of this. All right, so my trick is always, I put my mirror underneath me because, oh, that's smooth. Okay, so the trick always is put your mirror right underneath you. It helps you, instead of looking up, Good, Kristen. Instead of looking up and I always end up getting mascara like on this part of my eye, I don't want to do that. So I always sort of put it even with me or just beneath me and get mascara here. Whoops. We'll fix that. Put a little of that translucent setting powder on it'll go right away hi andrea does this happen to anyone else in the winter or is it just me this winter my eyelids have been dry like when did that become a thing it's amazing the things that you notice that happen to you when you get older that didn't happen to you when you were younger like 35 your eyelids get dry at night what's the deal okay so that's just one coat of the mascara love it I love that it pulled each individual lash apart because it does not look, they don't look clumpy whatsoever. All right, I'm gonna do a second coat and then we're gonna compare side to side what's happening there. I like that the wand is not, I hate really large wands. They feel very cumbersome to me. So I like that this one is not a massive wand. I always do two coats. Eyes and nose, Andrea, really? Hi, Lauren, I just got your text. Um, but obviously I couldn't reply. Okay, so. So we're gonna do the second eye, but I'm definitely happy with that. That is a good before and after, which I'm always way too lazy to take. There was one I used to watch a lot of presenters do their thing. And that was sort of how I learned, like everything that I ever did in um, direct sales was very much self-taught. Um, I'm definitely excited about the opportunity with Arbonne because I have had more support 
in the last less than a week that I have been an Arbonne consultant than I did in the two years with my previous company. Uh, literally, I get a text every day. If there's anything I can help you with, please let me know. I'm here to help you. These are like, I've already attended trainings. I've already had people offer me all of the upcoming trainings that are coming on, um, sit in on a Zoom call, attend an event, blah, blah, blah. It's really amazing. Um, but everything that I've ever learned was sort of from watching other people and determining if I liked it or if I didn't like it. Um, so I'm excited to sort of have someone show me the ropes this time around. Oh, mascara is just life. I'm gonna stop applying mascara now, I promise. All right, so let's finish strong with lips. So I have a few different lip products. I have a peach lip liner, I have a hazel lip gloss, and I have a lipstick in Magnolia. So let's start with lip liner in peach, which reminded me of my favorite shade from Unique that they discontinued called Prim. No, Plush, Plush. I keep trying to open these boxes from the wrong end. Okay. Lip liner in the shade Peach. Hi, Molly. Goes on incredibly smooth. I like that it's mechanical. And it's very like the perfect nude. All right, so let's go in with lipstick. This is in the shade Magnolia, another neutral. Oh, so pretty. This is gonna be perfect for spring, which by the way, spring is in 56 days. And tonight it gets dark at five o'clock. Just in case you were wondering. I'm already on top of it. All right, and now I'm gonna top this with the shade Hazel Lip Gloss. Really pretty, like look how gorgeous that is. Oh, so Hazel is like a nude with a touch of orange in it. And it smells so good. You guys, I am really, really, really pleased with that. I'm gonna put a little bit more high, um, of this translucent setting powder on underneath my eyes and I'm gonna use the sponge to do it. Just like this. Cause it's gonna sort of highlight and brighten. Look at how it brightens it up. And there are literally just like little shimmer shine pieces in it that makes it glow. A translucent powder that makes you glow. Hi, I'm here for that energy. Oh, Brandy, it's so pretty. It's like, you know, one of the things that I was sort of irritated about myself is like, I don't know, if you've followed me for the last few months, you'll probably know this without me having to say it, but I have been making a lot of really big changes to myself lately. Um, um, thank you so much, Brandy. I appreciate that. I've been making a lot of big changes to myself lately and just kind of like ruthlessly editing my life of things that just like don't serve me. Um, that's the house. That's my friends. That's my food. That's my makeup. That's my pro like all of the things. And I think that losing my dad was like a huge wake up call about um, just like what ends like the end of your life. What do you want to look back at? Do you want to look at the things that you did or the things that you didn't do? Do you want to look back and, and blame someone for holding you back? Or do you want to look at yourself and be proud that you like stepped out of your comfort zone or you grabbed the bull by the horns? And so I kind of went into this year and I was like, listen, not for nothing, but 
I need to clean off my plate a little bit. I need to get rid of clothes I haven't worn in 15 years. I need to rip out the carpet, it's disgusting. I need to change my diet and get off of all of the garbage I was eating. I like just kind of made a mental note of the things that I was doing because I was too lazy to change them. And now, <laughs> I, like I can honestly say it it's resonated with a lot of people and they were like I'm doing the same and it hasn't gone over well with some people who didn't want me to make those changes because it didn't include them um, but it was really the right thing for me so I'm just going into 2020 with like the outlook that I can do better and so I need to like 2020 Megan is big hoops Lizzo playing the flute in her thong on stage no apologies all love and light, nothing but positivity for you sort of vibes. And that is, was, will be my biggest motivation in switching to Arbonne was that like in the last 10 days, let me show you something. All right. In the last 10 days that I've been doing the detox, these pants did not fit that way 10 days ago. Like this is bananas. Um, like I always took reasonably good care of myself, but I I could do better and so I am. I totally understand girl. I've been going through the exact same process and it feels so amazing. It's very hard some days but so worth it. Thank you Brandy. I mean it's hard for sometimes to say these things and not sound like super self-absorbed because sometimes I feel like that's how it comes off but I even tell it to my kids and things like that. Like, if you don't want this anymore, let's get rid of it. Let's give it to somebody who needs it. Let's, what do you want to do? What do you want to spend your time doing? If you don't like it, let's not do it anymore. Let's like, and I just feel like going through the year like that, I already have such a better outlook on and like excitement for things like the sparkle in my eyes is definitely returned and I only lost my dad six weeks ago like that is super super fresh that wound um and and losing my dad was really really difficult um but it just made me realize especially with the health and nutrition that like I could do things now I'm very sorry for the loss of your heart always sending you lots of low healing strength Brandy you're so sweet thank you um, it made me realize that there are things that I should be doing now for myself to prevent me from ever being in a similar position um, with a degenerative heart disease. And so things like trying to be more plant-based, all of the Arbonne's products are organic, um, vegan, cruelty-free, dairy-free, soy-free, all of that. Um, I started that back in November. So I was already doing this before Arbonne kind of fell in my lap. And I just sort of get these signs that like it was the right thing for me to do. Um, I started not to like myself as much because I just felt like I was wearing a mask every day and I just kind of wanted to be more authentically myself and that feels really good now. But beyond that, um, like I got off coffee, for example, losing my dad was so hard. It's been almost two years. So happy that you were taking care of you. Self-care is not selfish. Say more. Um, self -absor yeah, uh. I know that and I love that and I love that other people that have been through it. I think that there is like a a little facet of people who have never experienced what it's like to lose somebody or like watch someone slip away from them that don't get how hard like you're never going to be okay, which sucks. That sucks so bad to admit that you're never going to be okay that they're gone. Like I'll never ha have peace with the fact that he's not here. But um, I learned, I learned a lot. I'm excited to look at these new products. Thank you so much for bringing them to me. Oh. Don't cry off my new mascara. It's really good. Anyway, um, you know, like the nutrition is what started me. Oh, Chelsea, I love you too. Um, the nutrition is what started me with Arbonne because I was using protein powders when I was working out and they were all making my skin break out because they all contain soy isolates and that is really bad for my skin. Other people can metabolize them better, but not me. Like I get like a beard of zits. So there is no soy. It's all pro P 
pea protein. There's no whey protein. There's no animal pro byproducts of any kind. And I started using the nutrition and then I was like, this is the right stuff for me. So then now I'm drinking the detox tea and the fizz sticks. I can honestly say since I started the fizz sticks and detox tea, I have had more consistent energy throughout the day without experience that like three o'clock crash. I've had more mental clarity and nothing else has changed other than I cleaned up my diet and I got off of like garbage. Uh, you find a new normal. I try to think of the good all the times so I talk to mine. I do too. Um, is there a weight loss line? I need help losing my baby late. Yes. Um, so right now, Angeline, you're going to love this. So right now we have a 30 day healthy living bundle. Um, I can send you the link. It's amazing. So it comes with two bags of protein, a digestion plus two um, boxes of fizz sticks, two boxes of detox tea, uh, a a um, two boxes of greens, a free gift, free shipping, and 20 to 60% off of my website for a year. It's 50% off right now until the end of the month. And we have a new group starting on February 3rd. And so I would add you into that Facebook group. It gives you shopping lists. It gives you, um, it's called an accountability group, but it's really just other people doing it with you. So you don't feel like you're doing it alone. Recipes, shopping list, ideas, you have two shakes a day, you have a nice dinner or a breakfast or lunch, however you want to do it. I intermittent fast, so I don't, I have the tea in the morning and then I'm honestly not hungry until noon. I have a shake then and then I have dinner. Um, I've been on my own spiritual life journey this past year and I'll be working even harder this year for what I want and need or not only myself, but most of the time my three beautiful babies. Absolutely, Brandy, do that. Yes, um, I'll send you that. Angela, you are going to love this. Like I said, okay, so this is only 10 days. These pants fit me 10 days ago. Look at that. Like, yes, I have mom bod. I have stretch marks. Like, it's real. But this is 10 days of my jeans. These are size 6 jeans that were, like, I couldn't do this 10 days ago. And I have not changed, I haven't changed my workout at all. I've just like cut out a lot of toxic things in my body that I thought were healthy. And I had just been used to using, like it's easier to do this because I know how and I've been doing it this way for so long. Um, when you detox out, you can do anything for 30 days. I'm not even drinking two shakes a day because like I said, I drink, this has three and a half like it contains three and a half cups of water. So when I put one tea bag and one fizz stick in it, I literally sip on this all morning until I'm like, oh my gosh, it's noon. And then I have my shake and the shakes are so good. And sometimes after dessert or after dinner, I'm like, you know what? I still have another shake that I could have. And if I have a sweet tooth, I'll make a chocolate shake with almond butter, almond milk and a banana in it. And it's it's delicious. My kids are drinking it. I'm putting the powdered greens into the kids' smoothies every day. They have no idea. One tiny scoop of the powdered greens has 37 servings of fruit and vegetables in it. My kids don't get 37 servings of fruit and vegetables a week. Hand to God. And they just had each 37 servings with breakfast. And they had no idea. They're, pra they're like, this tastes like Skittles. How did you make smoothies taste like Skittles, mom? And there are no, like, I have a child with ADHD. Chase cannot have red dye. It's so bad for him. He is off his rocker for days, like a good 48 hours plus. He is a friggin' maniac. Um, there are no artificial sweeteners. There are no synthetic colors or dyes, like none of that. And I have to read every ingredient like a psycho when I'm doing that. But literally Chase's favorite thing now is vanilla protein with strawberries and blueberries frozen because they're cheaper, almond milk and half of a banana. The kid comes home from school and he's like, can I have one of those milkshakes again? Dylan likes chocolate banana. He doesn't like peanut butter in it. He likes chocolate and banana. And I know that they're not getting junk. Like it's more protein and it's all vegan plant-based. So um, if you are working out, it's a really great supplement to add. If you're just looking to kind of like get rid of some holiday weight or something, if you're looking to make a major change and you just want like that big jump start in the, in the beginning, get the 30 day healthy living bundle before the end of the month. And I will sign you up for all the accountability groups Starts February 3rd. You just have to message me and let me know and then I can add you to them. Literally, shopping lists, recipes, 
all the ideas, all the people that are like, hey, just so you know, I just tried this and it was amazing. You can, I'm gonna make them later, but they're little cookie dough protein ball bites that I can't wait to make. And you can eat them like cookie dough. Like who doesn't like cookie dough? I literally put my life at risk to not get salmonella by eating cookie dough. But this stuff is so good. I wouldn't, I wouldn't have invested, get gotten rid of a two and a half year investment that I made with my previous company to come to something that I didn't truly believe in. And like, the more I look at this makeup, the more I feel like myself. Like I said, I felt like I was starting to sort of wear a mask and sort of adopt what other people were doing as me. And I just feel like more me now. I feel like a little bit more, this is who I am. Not that I wasn't before, but I just kind of felt like it wasn't as out there. So um, ain't nobody got time for that, truthfully. You love it or you don't, and that's good. And I'm on this path right now. So if you want the 30 day healthy living bundle, I would be so in love if I could help you get that, get it this weekend. That way I can get you into the February 3rd thing. The shipping, literally when I hit order process, I literally get an email 10 minutes later, your order is shipped with a tracking number. Like it is so efficient and speedy. So I wanna see as many of my friends succeed this year as possible. If I can be here for you to help you do that, I would feel like literally beyond blessed to be able to do that. So um, it's great even if you have autoimmune issues, gut issues especially, the Digestion Plus, the Fiber Boost are so gentle on your track. They literally heal you from the inside. They're infusing you with vitamins and minerals that your body is depleted of that you're not getting from other things. Um, so get, get me a message, comment on this video. I'm here to help you. Um, I will be back on Tuesday. You're gonna see a lot of these same products until my new, my next order of makeup comes. Um, I just didn't wanna come in too hot and be like, look at what I have, because that can be a little bit aggressive. But um, like I said, this feels a lot more like me and I hope that you will join me on this journey and feel a whole lot more like you. So um, drop me a message if you need to be shade matched for any makeup, if you want to get the kit, if you, you know, I always recommend people become um, preferred customers because you just save a ton of money that way. You get 20 to 60% off every time you order, plus free shipping, plus free gifts. I already have a free night cream and a free exfoliating face scrub, full size. You're not getting like itty bitty things. And they sent me this whole hair care kit for free. Just like, hey, thanks. Try this stuff. You'll love it. So I'm all about it. Um, sorry for going on for so long. This was extensive, but I had a lot to say. So I love you guys and I will see you back here on Tuesday and have a great Sunday with your family. If you want the 30 day healthy living, just send me a message and we'll get you signed up right now. And that way on February 3rd, we can really take off together. Mwah. Love you guys.